simplify the following trig identities. So what we have here is what we can do. All right, so go ahead and multiply this out. So tangent squared x plus one is the same thing as the secant squared x. So we can do that inside here. So we end up with secant squared x plus two tangent x All right, and then distribute the cosine x across all of these. So we end up with, ugh. so we end up with <clears throat> just secant x or, cause one of the cosines on the bottom cancel out. Plus this cancels out. So we get two sine x. I think this is, that's about as simple as we can go. And that's it. Okay, I hope this helped you out. I appreciate you watching, and you have yourself a fantastic day.